Hey, thanks for coming by and checking out my YouTube channel again, Pete's Snake Bite Kit. Hey, if you've been here before, you know what this video is about. It's about putting together this Cobra I've been working on for a while. And what we're doing now is I'm getting close to being able to put the body on. So it's not painted yet, but I'm gonna put the body on and go through all the shakedowns and being able to drive it, get it registered, and seeing what leaks and getting it aligned and all those things before I take it back apart to paint it. Anyway, let's look at some details that are gonna come along with putting that body on. So here's what we're gonna be working on here. The headlights I've got in, I'll show you those on the body. I've got the front marker lights put on the body. Gonna to need to put on the tail lights, the license plate light. Of course, windshield, that's gonna be a bit of a project. That'll actually be getting out of the box and putting on the car once the body's mounted. I'm gonna put three mirrors on it. Gonna have a center mirror on the dash and then two side mirrors, I'll show you those. Need to get the hood hinges on and the latches to hold the hood down. The trunk hinges and the latches and then the doors and the latches. So let's take a look at these pieces. Do a quick walk around on the car. The engine's in, the radiator and shrouder out at the fabrication shop getting this shroud built to mount the electric fan to the radiator. But we've got a lot of details done in the engine compartment. Got the dash in, got the seats in, got the seat belts in. Got the side pipes on. Steering linkage, throttle linkage. All those little goodies. Coolant expansion bottle. So here's the goods we still need to put on. This mirror, period correct, that's going to go in the center of the dash. And then I like these ray dot mirrors. I got these. I like the spun aluminum look. These are actually going to be on each side of the window frame. And I found these brackets that hopefully I can adapt onto the window frame. So those would be the two side mirrors. Then these latches are not original, original, but very look very much like the uh, originals. They work exactly the same way as they would on the original one. So we'll get the doors mounted, get the hinges set and adjusted and the strikers and so on. And then I need to put the whole gas cap assembly on to the body. This will come up from underneath and will mount into the Le Mans style cap. I've still got a vent for the fuel tank I need to put on. Then these are the, the tail lights. These are rectangle because this is a 427 car. Some of the uh, 428 cars had round tail lights. And interestingly enough, a lot of the replicas that are made to sort of look like a 427 FC don't have rectangular tail lights. They have two round tail lights uh, to each his own. And then this is a license plate light mount. Need to mount onto the trunk. So these are the quick jacks. These will go on the front and the back of the car about where bumpers would be on a normal car and a big bar would hit across here with a big lever that you'd be able to pull on and lift the front of the car off the ground or the back of the car off the ground. I'm not going to use them for that, but that's why they're there. That's what those funny looking hooks are on the front of the car. So I have the headlights in, I've got the front marker lights on. And these look kind of funny because they're tilted out to the side a little bit because that's exactly how an original 427 Cobra was. Again, this body is taken from a 3000 series car. And I've got the hood scoop on. I need to get some longer screws for the back. They take a little bit longer screw and that's not quite mushed down there. And then the latches for the hood I'll mount in there. So we're gonna put this body on that chassis you just saw. Hopefully get this all done and running and moving in the next month or so and have some fun driving it. Okay, there you have it. Those were all the pieces and things uh, pretty much that I need to get together, get on the car and adjust it and make it all fit and happy. So I will drive it around with the body just in that black gel coat. It'll, it'll look fine, it'll 
look like a cobra and I'll be driving it. That'll be the main part. Uh, my plan is to get it all debugged and worked out and then probably take it back apart towards uh, the, the fall time of this year and you know get it to paint when it's uh, cold here and I'm not gonna be driving it anyway. So that's what it looks like. Hey, thanks for watching this video. Getting close to driving this thing around, so that's pretty exciting. Hope you're enjoying these and stay tuned because there's gonna be more.